Okay, welcome back to the 4-4 notes. Um, I do want to go through this proof with you guys, and it's not a terrible proof, um, but let's go ahead and start this off by writing out our, uh, our T-chart here. And remember, I want to put statements here, statements, and then reasons. Okay, and the first thing I want to do is I want to list off my given statements. And so I know that PR, my first statement, uh, PR is congruent to DE, okay, and that's a DE, and that's uh, given to us, okay. Uh, the second step is that PT is congruent to DE, okay, and actually, that should, that should say DF, okay. Uh, PT is right here, and DF is here. So I'm going to change that up and uh, call that DF. Okay, and that's given to us. Okay, uh, we also know um, that angle R, okay, is congruent to angle E. Okay, and that's also given. Okay, and then we know that uh, angle T is congruent to angle F. Okay, and that's also given. So um, what I want to prove is that these two triangles are congruent. Now what I notice here is that I have this side and this side are congruent, and this side and this side are congruent, okay? But I have that these, uh, I, and, and I would like to use side angle side, Okay, I want to show that P is congruent to D, okay, but they don't give that to us, okay? They tell us that these two angles are congruent and these two angles are congruent. But what I know uh, from, from this uh, picture is that angle P is congruent to angle D, and that's by the third angles theorem, okay? And what that says, uh, if you remember, was that if two angles of a triangle, two corresponding angles of a triangle... Um, or two different triangles are congruent, then we know that their third angles have to be congruent. The third pair of angles have to be congruent. So um, I'm going to come over here, and I'm actually going to say, oh, come on, uh, that angle P is congruent to angle D. Okay, so my fifth statement is that angle P is congruent to angle D, and that's by the third angles theorem. Third angles theorem. Okay, and then um, because in that picture now I have a, a, two pairs of corresponding sides that are congruent, and their included angle. Okay, I have a side, an angle, and a side that are all congruent to this side, this angle, and this side. Okay, and I'm going to write that in there that I have a side an angle, and a side, a side, an angle, and a side. So then what I can then say is my proof statement. I now know that because I have side angle side congruence theorem that these two triangles are congruent. So my sixth statement is that triangle PRT is congruent to triangle DEF, okay? And the reason that I can say that is by side angle side. Okay, so really side, 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 and side, angle, side are, are the reasons, okay, why we can state that. So if you can show that then and use that, then that's what we can do with those proofs. So um, hopefully uh, that was helpful for you. Um, go ahead and get started on your homework and see, as much, see how much you can get done. Thanks. Bye.